Tie Styles back with another video. A lot of ignorant people had a lot to say about the passport bros and the women they choose. Now, believe it or not, the women from the Philippines are clapping back hard, regardless of what the panderers of modern women and passport bro haters are saying. Filipino women are speaking out and also they support long term relationship and marriage minded passport bros. Guess what? We got the proof right here. But you don't have to take my word for it. Hey, you, American woman who degrading Filipino woman who cannot speak English and being poor. So what? At least we have morals. What about you? You are the reason why American men, they go out overseas and looking for a wife. Because you are the reason. Here's why. Here's the reason why. Because American women are very feminist. They're feeling entitled. They don't respect their husband. They're argumentative. And what else? They don't clean the house. They don't make themselves look beautiful. They don't have a job. Oh, by the way, most Americans said that American women are very juvenile. And also they said, once you have the, the kids, once you have a kid, you flip your cookie. As for us, Filipino woman, the man that you don't want, we want. Because you know why? We have to, we're going to give this man a lot of love, respect. We're going to treat him like a king. We also, you know, we work because we contribute in the household. That's what we do. And we take care of ourselves, first of all. You know, we take care of our family, the elderly, everybody we take care of. So for you to say and degrade us, it's a no-no. We're going to start clapping because good for you that all the men are not marrying you. Because they need to be happy. So for all the passport pros, go to the Philippines and find yourself a, a wife. You're not going to be sorry. You're going to be happier. So for all the passport, passport pro out there, are Colombia, yes. uh, the Philippines, Thailand, like women can that can speak very little English. Wow, what the fuck? Well, for your information, Philippines is one of the fucking largest speaking English nations. And you know, English is one of our language. Well, if they're not the right man for you, then let them go. You know, it just make you look like you're jealous, you're insecure. You know, look at you. If you feel like you're beautiful, you're independent, why mentioning involving these countries? You know, even though they have, they speak a little English, damn, like, even me, I'm not perfect. My English is not perfect because it's not my first language. And, and in the Philippines, we have a lot of dialects that I can't even speak all of our dialects in the Philippines. And I can't even pronounce them perfectly. So how much more than English, huh? You know? Um, so if you don't want these men to leave your country, then be a better woman than they want to. And if they want to find that woman that they want in, in every country that you guys mentioned, then let them go. Let them go. Let them find their happiness and be happy for them. If they fail, then that's, that's the risk. If it didn't work for them, and that's none of your business right so it's like why are you guys pretending i want to be independent woman bad and that i don't need a man now you're talking about like this is there a shortage of men right now really stop throwing shades to filipinas because we are stealing your boyfriend come on anyway i hope you guys fix your relationship if you guys are going through some stuff in your relationship and stop looking at the philippines or other asian countries to blame okay have a great night it's night time here it's probably morning in america good morning america anyway 
Have a great night. Bye. Like women can that can speak very little English. Women that don't have and, education. And not, women that that need them. Women that need them. Women, that, need women them. are raised to be wives. Mm -hmm. They learn everything in the, in other from, communities, from yeah. birth, from That's their father, right. from their mother, <laughs> how to be a wife and how to support your man. Women that need them. It's not even women That's that need them. It's women that treat them with respect. So we don't. Y'all know y'all don't. Stop. <laughs> no, like, stop just stop. Know That's don't. not true. <laughs> okay. I am so relaxed at this moment. While watching this video, I was just thinking, hmm, these little girls do not know what they're talking about. Obviously, they did not do any research when it comes to other countries, specifically the Philippines. Okay, girls, yes, girls, listen up. I am from the Philippines. I speak two languages. Do you speak to two languages? And if you do not, then that makes me smarter than you are. Now, don't call us uneducated because we are. We take, educate, we take education very seriously. You know why? Because we have to pay for it out of our own money. Unlike you, you probably have the government help you out. So please, just please do not make other countries or other people lower than you are because you know what that just makes you very very little like you're down there just saying mm -hmm. and i love the best the best part of that video is the the last part and yes you are not you're not capable of being a woman you're gonna stay as girls <laughs> You're not capable of being a wife. And if you're a wife, your husband's probably trying to get rid of you down the ditch. And if, you in, if you're in a relationship, you're not going to last long, girls. You won't. You're ugly. You're disrespectful. You are just racist. That's what you are. And you will always be one. Okay? That's all. <laughs> DR, Colombia, yes. uh, the Philippines, Thailand, like women can that can speak very little English. I saw this video a lot of times here on TikTok and this lady in a podcast is generalizing women from different countries which she mentioned and one of that is the Philippines and as a Filipino woman I would love to give my words here towards this lady in a podcast. And maybe you can learn something about me because maybe you don't know this one. So I am going to share to you a trivia. And this is a fact that the Philippines has a worldwide reputation of English fluency. And the Philippines also drops the 22nd ranking of the English proficiency all over the Asia and all over the world. That's how good Filipinos are when it comes to speaking in English. And funny how we can speak your language. And the question is, can you speak our language? So never ever belittle Filipinos or Filipinas when it comes to speaking in English because 92% of the Filipino people can speak English fluently. And let's go back to the main reason and the main topic here, which is the passport bros. Actually, it's not even your business when these men from your country will go overseas to find someone in Asia to be their life partners because that's their choice and they want to choose Asian women more than you to be their life partners. And I don't understand why are you guys are so mad and so angry and attacking also these men and of course attacking also Asian women to, to have this kind of situation. And actually, they have the freedom to choose who can be the best life partner for them and they know their worth already and I think Asian women can give a good love and a good reciprocity towards this man from your country and your words spoke volume of how insecure you are towards Asian women and simply explains that Asian women and also Filipinas can have a great great advantage more than you I am not going to generalize this one, but as I observe, other Western women feel so superior and entitled of themselves when in fact they are just simple people in their countries. So every man between the ages of 18 and 99 has a choice. 
they could choose to be with somebody like you with your potty mouth and your skid row attitude and your jiggling jelly thighs. Or they could choose to be with, I don't know, a slim, sexy Filipina <laughs> who always has two to three jobs, is likely to never be homeless in her life or get thrown in jail. I mean, it's a hard choice. But you like stereotypes, right? <laughs> Hold up, what you say about the Filipinas only understanding very little English. Listen to this video, girl. I'm going to give you a rundown, okay? Filipinas with very little education. Oh, honey, please. Please. Please tell me that you can only speak about us if you can be better than us. And clearly... You are so insecure because we take care of your man better than you. We understand perfect English as much as we speak it. And for one, a Filipina like me, for sure, for sure, has been to more countries in the world than you. The only place you've ever been with a mind like yours is the back of your man's truck. Hold up. I am being insulted. I'm just going to defend myself. Son, go inside the room. Listen to me. Do not insult us Filipinas because you know nothing about us. All you know is that your men are picking us over you. But then again, we kind of prefer, at least women like me, prefer hard men all the damn time. Iba pa rin ang Pinoy. Tony, please get out. I'm trying to school this woman because she doesn't know Jack Toot. Don't start with me, honey. I've already made a video before. If your men come to the Philippines or Thailand or any other Asian country, it's because they like Asian spice. We're spicy. We're delicious. We know how to take care of your men and ourselves. And we age well. Why do you think that is? Mm-mm. Why do you think they like us for our skin? They like us for our hospitality or they like us for the things we do that we can tell you on TikTok because we might get banned. <laughs> so don't start with me. Don't make an entire case that, oh, because we're so less. That's why they like us. No, honey. No, we're not less. In fact, we're more expensive. But then we can afford ourselves. You're talking about a very small portion. A very small portion of women who need your men to live. But if you are going to speak about the general population of empowered Filipinas, honey, please. We chose your men. It's not that your men chose us because we speak little English or that we don't have education. Honey, you know could die. Why don't you ask one of your Filipino friends to translate this? Ayaw mi glabda kay dili mo mga lami baho pag ibog ilo kung di mo kaligo kami bisan pagpila ka adlaw lami mi dili mi ninyo mapili mo na ko ako ninyo maghilo mo ingat Mwah.